Everybody's good? Okay. Well, I encourage you to ask as many questions as you like. I was trying to decide before today, do I want to prepare a speech? And I was like, no, we'll just um, talk. Be confident, but not cocky. You may know how to do or think you know how to do everything, but nobody's too big to learn. And so I'm still learning. I've been doing this since 2006, and I'm still learning every day. And I know that most of the people I work with have been in television way longer than I have. Um, but there's uh, always an opportunity to learn and perfect and grow and get better at what you're doing. So always be open to that um, as you, um, you know, embark either on a career in television or whatever field you might decide to go into. And also, don't be afraid to take notes if there is something interesting you want to remember. Um, and you're out on the job, it never hurts to jot it down, ask questions. Um, for myself, for example, if I have an intern that's with me and they're asking me about what I'm doing and they seem interested and engaged in what's going on, I'm more likely to want to help that person succeed and be successful than, uh, you know, somebody that just, I feel is just tagging along because their school told them they had to do an internship, so they're just coming along to, you know, waste time. Because, I mean, for me, it's fun to teach and show people, you know, what I do when I feel that they're interested and engaged and, and want to know about it. Um, most stations, including Channel 10, you can do a station tour. Um, they've got on the website where you can go on and sign up for those sorts of things. Um, and just to tour and see how the process works, see what a newsroom is like, um, see if it's an environment that you like. Um, if you don't get to do an internship immediately, look into job shadowing. Maybe go out with a reporter one day um, if you can set that sort of thing up and follow them through the process. I've had interns shadow me before and they just kind of, it's a different experience in the morning because we do a lot more running and gunning and, and trying to get to breaking news, but still just a way to see if that's something that you're interested in. Um, also, interning, uh, if you have those opportunities as well, a great way uh, to get your foot in the door and really get a, a more hands-on, everyday experience and, okay, here's how this works. Um, usually, if you're more of behind the scenes, you get to do more writing. If TV, on camera is what you're interested in, um, utilize any opportunities to go out with reporters and shoot stand-ups and go in and say, hey, um, do you mind critiquing this or telling me what I need to work on or how can I do this or that um, better? And just be engaged in, in trying to improve. Um, and generally, just set goals for yourself so that when you start that internship, it may be two or three months and you know you don't know if you're gonna have a job at the end, but set goals for yourself for what you want to accomplish by the end of that internship and, and get better. So. Um. <laughs>